Infinity family, welcome back to the channel. T Infinity 2, T Infinity here back again with another message for you. So, today we're taking a look into top of the week, top of the week, and we're gonna see what the archangels and the most high have for us for the next 48 to 72 hours. So, if you're new to the channel, thank you for being here, thank you for tuning in. This is going to be general. It's not going to resonate with everybody. But if it resonates with you, hit that thumbs up. Hit that bell. And subscribe. And become a part of the family. I would love to have you. <clears throat> so I see that it's like one subscriber that keeps subscribing and unsubscribing and subscribing and unsubscribing. I am sending you peace, love, and light. And I'm sending you a um i'm sending you energy and um a clear mind so that you don't be so indecisive about what it is that you want to do okay because i see that somebody keeps subscribing unsubscribing subscribing and unsubscribing okay so i hope that you um become sound minded very very soon okay so 123 on this clock one two three i see something is going exactly the way that it's supposed to be going we're going to start off with the prayers and promises from women okay prayers and promises for women i hope everybody had a beautiful weekend i hope that you all enjoyed your weekend i hope that everybody got rest and prepared for the full blood beaver lunar eclipse moon Heavenly Father, Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Archangels of all four corners, Mother Earth, come into this message for the Infinity 2 family and anybody that clicks onto this video. Give us the most important messages that we need to see concerning top of the week, top of the week, top of the week, and the full moon. Protect us, Archangel Michael, as we look into this energy as well. Ashe, Ashe, Ashe. Devotion. Devotion. Then Jesus said to his disciples, whoever wants to be my disciple must deny themselves and take up their cross and follow me. Matthew 16, 24. So I'm seeing that a lot of you have taken up your cross. A lot of you have given, has given yourself so that you can gain your relationship with Christ. That's what I'm hearing here. No servant can serve two masters. No servant can serve two masters. The servant will hate one master and love the other, or will follow one master and refuse to follow the other. You cannot, I repeat, you cannot serve both God and worldly riches. All right, so some of you are having difficulties, um, like I said, It's like, for some of you, you are devoted to the Most High God. For others of you, 333 on this clock, you're changing. You're changing. You, you are be, beginning to devote yourself to God. That's what I'm hearing here. Don't copy. Don't copy the behavior and customs of this world. But let God transform you into a new person i didn't even read this you guys this is just what i'm feeling by changing the way you think then you will learn to know god's will for you which is good and pleasing and perfect romans 12 2 so some of you could have been seeing 12 22 2 22 2 2 2 2 if you've been seeing any of those messages this message is definitely for you God, I belong to you. I adore you. I want to live my life. I want to live my life fully committed to you. Knowing Jesus laid down his perfect life for me, I want only to honor his sacrifice by doing the same because I am weak. I know that even though I want this, I can't do it without your help. So strengthen me, God, to live my life for you. I surrender all I am. And all I have to your will. How can you devote your life to God today? Okay? How can you devote your life to God?
to God today. So that was your message from the prayers and promises for women. If this message is resonating with you and you want to devote your life to God and you want to gain a closer relationship to God, then stick on, stay and watch this video. Because top of the week, top of the week, top of the week, this is what this must be about. Devotion. And if this message is not resonating with you, go check out your sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node side on my channel. Or you could go check out the other channel, T Infinity, that might have some messages for you as well. Okay, so family, we're going to begin with some messages. All right, I cut it on July, you guys, and you're protected and connected. So it's 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 a situation where you protected, you connected, you are um out of the world. You have brought I'm getting hermit energy, real talk. You have brought yourself out of the world and you are connecting more to God. There's someone else here. Their they birthday could be in July. Or this person could be a Cancer or a Leo. I'm hearing that as well. This person wants to come out of the world as well. So you could be a Cancer. You want to come out to this world. You want. You could be a Gemini, I heard as well. You could want to come out of this world. Or you could be a Leo. You could want to come out of the world. And you could want to gain a better relationship with God. Okay, that's what I'm hearing for, for some of you. But others of you, we're going to see what's going on here. Okay. Top of the week, top of the week, top of the week. Okay. Freeze. So somebody doing a freezer spell. Somebody is doing a freezer spell on you, Infinity Family, for this full moon. I don't know why. I keep seeing two studio and at night and then nighttime came out again right here. So you could have been involved in a fake ass partnership. That's what I'm seeing here. You could have and look early morning under that. So you could have been involved in a fake ass partnership. This fake ass partnership I'm hearing here is um getting exposed. This fake ass partnership is getting exposed. Something happened at nighttime. I'm seeing that as well. Okay. Royalty was poking out in the back. So somebody knows that you're royalty. Somebody knows that you're royalty. And we're going to see what fell on the floor. All right. Somebody feels like you are watered down or something is watered down, Infinity Family. I'm not sure what that is. Somebody co continues to make empty promises towards you. This came out of another message before. Build a portfolio for for so for some of you, you definitely need to build a portfolio. This top of the week, top of the week. That's what I'm hearing here. Build a portfolio with all of your, um, with all of your work in it. Work on your craft. Work on your craft. I'm seeing that July and March. July and March could be significant. Eight eighteen on this clock. <clears throat> There's an investor that's watching you, that's want, wanting to come invest in you this top of the week, top of the week. And why? Because you are a boss big deal. Because you are a boss big deal. All right? So, there's something taking place at nighttime between the time of 6 p.m. and 11 p.m. So, be mindful of that. There's a fake-ass partnership that you also need to be mindful of. Okay? Okay? And something could be taking place at the studio at night. A debate, maybe an argument for some of you. Or some of you could have been arguing about a fake-ass partnership that you had with another man or another woman at nighttime with someone. That's what I'm seeing here. Or you will. You need to um, embrace your gypsy energy. That's what I'm hearing here. Embrace your gypsy energy. And last but not least, yeah, because your ancestors are guiding you. And this is an ancestor guided message. That's what um, I'm hearing here. So take heed. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this and clarify these. All right. So we're going to clarify July and March. Something could have taken place in July that you're going to find out about in March. That's what I'm hearing here. All right, so let's go ahead and clarify this. We're using the witch, modern witch tarot deck today. This could have to do with a Gemini. Didn't I already say that? So something could definitely have to do with a Gemini. Somebody could have feel betrayed. 
seeing that as well somebody could be feeling like it's hard to put something back or it's hard to do something again yeah somebody is paying it somebody feels like it's hard to work something out with you or they feel like it's hard for it's hard to work in love that's what i'm seeing here it's hard to work something out when it comes to love yeah because they broken hearted this could be a gemini um dealing with a cancer that's what i'm hearing here top of the week top of the week Somebody feel like it's hard to work something out with a cancer or somebody is working something out with a cancer or a Gemini. That's what I'm hearing here. Or somebody could just be working out something when it comes to love. Something is hard. Somebody is stubborn. Something is not working out the way that somebody wants it to. Yeah, look. You could be Aquarius, don't have to be, but you're healing and you're working hard on your craft. The 1101 on this craft. What is July? Why did you show us July here? Four of Pentacles. Because somebody wants to hold back from you or is holding back from you. Yeah, because they're juggling you. Two of Pentacles. This is somebody that's all about the money. This is somebody that's all about the money. This person is juggling you. Yeah, because they carry a heavy burdens because they want to hold on to you instead of let you go. This person also wants you to put down your boundaries. This could be a fire sign or a Gemini, queen of swords. Somebody is using their intellect to um, hold on to somebody. Like somebody is, or a Leo, didn't I say this? Somebody is holding on to somebody because of their strength. That's what I'm seeing here. But somebody also wants somebody to let their guards down. That's what I'm seeing here. Somebody feels burdened, too, because somebody don't want to let their guards down. And they could be watching you. They could be uh, paying close attention to you and wanting to make an offer towards you. That's what I'm seeing here, yeah, in this new cycle. Okay? This could be taking place in March. Or they could have been wanting to make this offer to, to you since July, 1222 on this clock. Build a portfolio. Take what resonates, leave the rest. Why you say build a portfolio here? Okay, because somebody could be building a portfolio with your work. I'm hearing that. Somebody could be building a portfolio with your work. Yeah, but it's not working out for them. Four of Cups, 1244 on this clock, and that, now they over it. You see this shirt says over it. This person is over it because they don't have the intuition that you have. And this person is also over it because they trying to build a portfolio with your work. This top of the week, top of the week, top of the week. That's what I'm hearing here. Then I already show y'all this. Then I already show y'all this. This could be a, a Gemini, Aquarius, or a Libra. They hurt to the fullest because they want to copy your work so bad. This person got a phone and both of these cards. This, this is a phone in both of these cards. This person is sitting up here watching you and wanting to build a portfolio, build a portfolio with your work. They only have two things to show and they looking at everything that you have. This person wants to do the work that you do, but they don't want to put in the work. That's what I'm hearing here. Yeah. So they're going to copy you. Now they're having a hard time sleeping at night because I feel like they're getting exposed for this, this full moon. Mm-hmm. Because they can't be sneaky no more. Seven of Swords in reverse. This karmic. This karmic is pissed because they getting caught. Because they getting caught for copying you. They getting caught for copying you. Seven and seven. King of Cups. They could have been dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, like I already said. And this could have been your significant other. King of Wands. Queen of Wands. King of Wands. Right here, y'all. 14, 14 on this clock. So now somebody is getting exposed for copying you and um, trying to build a portfolio off of your work. Because somebody promised somebody something and it was an empty promise. And then now they cannot fulfill their promise. So I'm getting somebody also went to a practitioner and they paid this practitioner to do some type of voodoo on you or some type of root work or some type of dark magic. And this person could not do it. They could not do it. And they made a, per they made a promise to this person that they was going to be able to do it. But they didn't. They couldn't because you was too strong. See? Ten of Swords coming in reverse. They couldn't do nothing to you because you were too strong. I could not make this shit up. And you protected in the spiritual realm and in the physical realm. This cancer here. 
15 on his clock. This person, I, yo, I cannot make this stuff up. If you want to book a personal reading, all you got to do is contact me. My information is in the, in the description below. This is a Gemini, Virgo, or a Cancer. These people made empty promises, and somebody made empty promises towards them. Then I say I'm getting Virgo energy. Then I said, I'm getting the hermit energy at the beginning, running back. Because these people was doing magic on you. And they was paying a practitioner to do magic on you. And it did not work. And that is the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. Do you see this? This is a Gemini, Virgo, a Cancer, and a Leo. Nothing happened to you. They paid a practitioner to do work on you. Death spells, cemetery spells, root work, voodoo. This person could have went to a voodoo high priestess. That's what I'm hearing here, a bruja. This person also could have went to a tarot card reader that lied to them. That's what I'm hearing here. And now everything is coming out. That is the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. This, these people did rituals on you. Three of cups. And that shit was water the fuck down. Y'all see how that sun coming out now? That joint is shining, shining. They magic was watered down. That's what Holy Spirit is telling me. Why you why you show me watered down? See? They try to send you conflict, chaos, and everything else. And that shit was watered down. And, and now they having conflict and chaos. Because this person... Because why? You was protected. You was protected. And they're getting karma you was protected do you see this you was protected by your archangels they asked us again the tower moment now all your wishes is being fulfilled because they tried to sit up here and breadcrumb you and pay a practitioner to do voodoo on you root work on you and magic on you this gemini tried to be sneaky with this king of cups do y'all see this shit i could not make this shit up and they tried to do a freezer spell on you, but they couldn't because you work on your craft and you a boss big deal, baby. Freeze. Freeze. Why you show us freeze, Holy Spirit? Because this person tried to freeze your justice. This person tried to freeze your money. This person tries to freeze your income. This person tried to freeze everything so that you will not receive justice, Holy Spirit said. And that you would be waiting. Three of wands. That you would be, what is this? The emperor. Do y'all see that? This is the masculine that's doing this. This is the masculine that is doing this, y'all. This person wants you waiting. They did a freezing spell on you. Four of pentacles. Or pentacles to hold your money back, to hold you back, to hold your justice back. That's what I'm hearing. But you still going to get justice just because it, they did that. Why you show us work on your craft, please? This is for the full moon and everything, y'all. Why you show us work on your craft, please? The person from your past. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio for some of you. This person is sitting up here knowing that you are who you are. They still doing magic on you. They know you work on your craft. They know that you're intuitive. They know that you chose the path to righteousness. They know that you have somebody that truly does love you as well. 22. Do y'all not see this? And then I called this out at the beginning. I said, you could have been seeing 22. You could have been seeing 222. You could have been seeing 1202. Right? Because this person knows that you love yourself and you destined for the Ten of Cups. Because you work on your craft. Regardless of whether or not these people try to cause conflict in your life. And that's confirmation. You moving on to calmer waters, Six of Swords. Because you a boss big deal. And somebody is willing to invest in you. Come this full moon. Why you show us boss big deal? Why you show us boss big deal? Holy Spirit. See? Because you... Y'all hear them sirens? Because this is what's happening in the spiritual realm. You, Most High is blessing you with a new opportunity. Most High is blessing you with a new endeavor. And you holding it in your hand. You holding it in your hand come this full moon. Do you see this? And there's nothing that nobody can do. There's nothing that nobody can do to stop you because you're in a new cycle. And you're protected by the Holy Spirit, the archangels. Regardless of whether this person is angry towards you, this king of wands that has a lot of passion towards you and wants to come towards you with some aggression. They a motherfucking fool, the Holy Spirit said. And you go ahead and take your leap of faith to the leap to the new opportunity that Most High is granting towards you. Y'all hear them sirens. Y'all hear them sirens. Investor investor why did you show us investor for this full moon holy spirit why did you show us for the top of the week 
Because somebody is so hurt that you have somebody that's willing to invest in you. I showed you the two of cups. This person is investing money, time, love. This person is investing loyalty. This person is investing integrity. This person is investing worth. This person is investing in you, period. Think I'm playing. King of Pentacles. For some of you, this is not your significant other. For some of you, this is somebody new. Okay? Divine Feminine. And they jealous of you. Your masculine and who did karmic whoever they deal with, they is purely jealous of the fact that you have somebody that's investing in you because they asses did. And they was trying to bind you with magic. Do you see this? Eight of swords. I cannot make this shit up, y'all. This full moon. Now hit that bell if you feeling this message. Comment below if this message here is resonating with you. Okay, because this is the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth. And y'all already saw it, and they know it, and they know it. And look how they look for a source. They sick over this. They sick at the fact that everything that you say is true because your ancestors is guiding you. And they telling you, and they telling you what? That these people is the devil. The devil. And they've been doing dark magic on you. I already showed you the magician. Run it back. This is the devil and the moon card. Okay? Because they wanted you to be nine of swords. But now they're nine of swords. And the four of swords. And the eight of swords. So, Holy Spirit, why did you show us ancestor-guided messages? Ancestor-guided messages here. Because your ancestors from your past, your past life, and everything is telling you six of cups this person from your past is who's doing this okay because this person wants to deny you from your love this person wants to deny you from your healing this could be a gemini or a aquarius pisces cancer scorpio why are you showing six of cups here for the ancestor guidance the same person that's watching you and breadcrumbing you this is the person from your past a knight of pentacles that you already know Two, 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 two on this clock, Queen of Cups. 22, 22. Go look that up. Okay, because you have a new opportunity in love with somebody that is really the King of Pentacles. This Taurus full moon. Hit that bell. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Okay, later for this fake-ass partnership. Something might take place at night, y'all, so be aware. Embrace your gypsy spirit, okay? And let's get a boy out of here. We gonna go ahead and post some angel an angel answers before we go. Thank you for tuning in. Hit that thumbs up. Hit that bell. You do have an investor coming towards you, so be mindful about that. Continue to work hard on your craft and listen to your intuition. We gonna go ahead and post some angel answers. Then we getting up out of here, y'all. I hope the sun wasn't too bright. I love the sunlight. Y'all know I love sunshine on me. <laughs> So, yeah, this shit is unlikely. This magic or whatnot that they trying to do. And it's perfect timing because I'm telling you at the perfect time exactly what's happening. Because that's what the Holy Spirit is telling me. And remind you, this was an ancestor guided message. 2323 on this clock. 2333, excuse me. Look, choose a new direction. They mad because you chose a new direction. Infinity 2 family. They upset because you chose a new direction and you decided you didn't want to be around no devilish, toxic ass energy. Most I said forgiveness. Forgive these people, okay? Because they know not what they do to who they do it to, especially when they doing shit to you. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, thank you so much. Close this message on out with some angel answers. Peaceful resolution for you, Infinity Family. Come this full moon. Your angels is watching over you. For sure, for sure. You're ready. You level up. You ascended now. You on your next journey. That's what I'm hearing here. You moving on to your next journey. 24-24, y'all. That's two years. Look, it's not the right time. It's not the right time for you to be trying to do some magic during a lunar eclipse. It's not a good time to do magic during a e lunar eclipse. And look, a year from now. So if you like the book of personal reading, communicate clearly. My information is in the description below. I love you. See you in my next video. 2444. Peace.